Holi is a Hindu festival that has been celebrated since ancient times. The Holi festival is celebrated as a way to welcome the spring and also seen as a new beginning where people can release all their inhibitions and start fresh. With that being said, you must be wondering how I ended up here. Well, well ask the same thing, I don't know either. What me there? So I tried their food, we played games, I learned some dance moves as well as I taught them a few of my own. It was an experience like no other as I got to experience firsthand a culture vastly different from my own. Alright, so there. I wish my would have been. Holly or holy? Holly. Oh shit, why did you feel like a holy? <laughs> Hey, yo. Yeah, so you don't know we there are other places. Yeah? Hol Holyfest. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. To so experience the Indian culture and among Pro other things. Yeah, we don't got to talk about that. No. <laughs> oh, Pichu, 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 Pichu. How is this here in Jamaica was held in Hope Gardens? As we enter, you can see us getting greeted and painted upon entrance. No one gets away. Immediately after getting in, me and my hunger belly still decided that hey, we are going to circle the food section to see what they had to offer. I don't know, go fast. Sam! Hey, you know, only every people in my premium come here after. Uh, it's a possibility. That would be discrimination. Yeah, you have too much here. Yeah. Oh, no, you actually do. That's actually. That's actually. That's actually. That's actually. That's actually. Hi. What do you have over here? I have a Gujarati delicacy. Dabeli. So that's Indian, again. Indian delicacy. Okay. Oh, What's in it? It's stuffed potatoes and bread. It's a little spicy, sweet and tangy. So potatoes and just work? But basically potatoes are boiled and they're mixed with some spices. Mashed potato kind of. Yeah, it tastes like, you know, gives you a flavor. Okay. And then it, there's a spicy peanuts and then onions and with some hot sauce and some tamarind sauce. Okay. I like to try it. Okay. Just give us a second, we are hotting it up. Oh, okay, 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 okay. What do you think of Potato. Yeah, peanuts. A little bit of peanuts. Some spiciness. Some spicy. Spicy one. Spicy peanuts. I'm gonna try for the for for that. Huh? Don't don't put me in this. Shall do it to the vlog. You won't do it. I shall not. I will not do it in the fucking thing. Alright, sure, no problem. I'm here for the okay. You know? Okay. Is it free or are you selling? <laughs> I selling like, you're selling? Oh, did not know that part. Uh, How much is free? <laughs> <laughs> so it was for free. How much is free? It's 800. 800. Oh, you guys take card? No, cash. Oh, cash. Well, what was that for you? 800. Why? I only have card. Mission failed. Mission failed. Mission failed. We'll get them next time. After leaving the spicy peanut tent, we moved on to the next one where they saw some things that I couldn't even pronounce the name of. Alright guys, if you're over here, we'll have the idili slash dosa butter. No ask me what that, but you get 4 pounds for 3 grand. If you want more information, you don't know. Watch up, watch up, you know? Yeah. Uh, and What's so special about the chicken journey? Holy uh, special. Yo, I can't pronounce that. What's that? 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 What's and what's so special about this chicken Oh, this is a steam um, made from the rice. It's steamed. It goes with the sambar here. Okay, this is the yiki. Okay. Okay. That's like bread. No. No. It is made from bread. It is made of matcha. Okay. Okay. Then you want to do the next one? It's steamed. Okay. And soft. Very soft. Okay. And it's not a dumpling, but 
you say you can say dumpling, but it's not a dumpling. Okay. This is a samba made with the Indian spices. And what else is in it? It goes with this and the chutney. Okay, so that's like sauce. Uh, this like curry. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Oh, it, is, it is curry or it's, it's like curry? Biryani. It is curry or it's like curry? It is curry. It is curry. It is, curry. Okay. It is South Indian curry. It's because we are here in Jamaica, we're used to curry being green, you know, we've never seen um, brown curry. Before. Oh, there are like, what do you, what do you say? We, we have brown, we have a clear one. You have clear curry? White, 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 curry. Curry. white, 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 Gravy. What is biryani? Oh, biryani is chicken biryani. Chicken cooked with the um, rice together. Together, what? Okay. Let's see the rice basically. Yes. Okay. Oh, it has got a spices. Okay. 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 Biryani, the biryani, biryani is on bad. You know that. Well, you know I don't that have a cash on me. Sorry, I walked there with I my. I eat the chicken and rice, and then I love the next morning you have little bit of chicken, little bit of rice, and just throw rice in the chicken and just mix it on. Yeah, man. Biryani. It's pretty. <laughs> Stay tuned to watch me eat all of them something here. Well, some of them. <laughs> we learned a lot. Who knew there was white curry? Much less clear curry. But anyways, moving right along. Food 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 some friends arrived as they had the bulab and it was apparently on sale. Hey yo! Hey yo, yo Mark. Hey, what are they doing? What you just said? You say you want almond milk? <laughs> we want, you want almond nut? She want give you almond nut? Yo, it's the Mark. Yo, every man say. Man say you want every man milk to blood. Hey, that, that didn't. Hey yo. Let's try it. Let's try it. Ask him a word in the list. No, they never give me a straight answer. That's how they treat you. If you're dead, I don't know. I'm a pump video. Me. <laughs> Let's say a word of silence. A brief moment of silence. And in loving memory of Road to Cool. With a side of this? Can I slurp it like soup? Yo, this is really sweet to me. This is literally sweet. This is sweet to me. This is sweet to me. It was nice knowing you both. And this is why I like my friends. <laughs> we live together, we all are we dead together. Me eat it, you must eat it too. We are all are we dead together. <laughs> You see, if you make it dry out, you can make before you eat it. <laughs> you know that, but you don't see that festival. No. So after tasting the early balls, <laughs> no. we saw some people dancing and decided that, hey, we're going to learn some Indian moves. A few moments later. Somewhere, somehow, I ended up being the one leading the Indian dancing. Don't ask me how it happened. It did. They even had rides and stuff for the kids and don't ask no me never go on them, them be too little. Naturally after them people are come with more Indian food. Hey that you go on the brother. What? Hey, this way. Me not understand all your buy soup in a food plate. I swear them not learning. You know? And clearly I didn't learn either. Cause I just had to try. <laughs> so guys, we have acquired Ron Billy. The body of it in here? Yeah, yeah, the four the four pounds of the four yeah. pounds, yeah. So we have four pounds of Italy right here right now. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
So move on it. So move on that rice. Rice butter. Rice. Is that like flour? Think flour. Yeah, but you move on that. So move on that rice. No, I think they soak it and then they steam it. Soak it overnight and then they steam it. Overnight, so steep rice. I'll try too much on this one. I want that too much. <laughs> How much did you guys pay for this? Right, yeah, thousand. All right, so guys, cost one thousand. What do you have? Over there, right? You get one of these. These taste really good. Be careful, don't touch. Chill. <laughs> Chill. It's <laughs> Stop it, man. So now I'm, I'm going to try it with the coconut. You know, like we can go to the restaurant. Smell it, and you know, you have to smell it and twirl it. And <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say it was um Hey look kids are dancing. So the kids performed and it was good. They danced real good and it was better than me in my opinion. We then opted to talk about the food tent as our other hunger belly friend has just arrived. This tent had some egg something something something. So we had to find out what the hell that thing is. We are going to investigate what is this egg substance. Hello? May I ask, um, what, what, what is this? What's that? What is that? This is called Pani Puri. Pani Puri? It's a very typical dish in India. You can find it in every... It's called Pani Puri? Pani Puri. What's it made of? Uh, it's made of, you know, the flour. So, yeah. Like how you make the Jamaican dumpling. Yeah. The Jamaican dumpling is like this. It, this is very flat. Okay. When you fry it, it becomes like a dumpling. See how it is? Okay. Yeah. And what's inside of it? Okay, they just do it like this, and then there is a uh, masala, masala. With the Irish, Irish and uh, cilantro and quite a few other things. They put it in. Okay, okay, okay. It's very good, and you have to you have to mix it the two waters. Get a really good taste. And if you are very spicy, so, the water that's that somewhere in your head. It's uh, the cilantro and all those spices, Indian spices. They make it, but it's very good. You will like it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's very interesting. So that thing that's right there. What was that? That's a masala. Well. Masala. It's Irish. Irish. The, the, what do you call it? Black, black chickpeas? Chickpeas. Oh, so Irish and black chickpeas. The explanation was very educational. However, me never did ever eat that. Other Jamaican in India, you don't know so we have to find the chicken, chicken. section. Oh, this is the lollipop part of the chicken I give you. They want the lollipop? Structural integrity now work out. And we certainly did. Well, kinda. They called it chicken lollipop. I mean, it wasn't bad, it was just different. It was in time for the games. The first of which was Tug of War. Looking back at it now, it was a little unfair for both me and my brother to be on the same team. But I mean, it is what it is. And after we see I go on for the next side of the rope, then me glad me never dip on the side there. Naturally, we won and on to the next game, which was the jumping about bag competition, so, which is what I call it. Till this day, no, I've been jumping in bags all my life. I actually jumped out of a bag and that is how I'm alive here to this day. So it's safe to say that I am a pro jumper. So we were here at the starting line and as the guy said go, me and my brother were neck and neck as we unleashed the forbidden one hand technique. <laughs> Very nice, very nice, one down, two down. Oh, very nice. The 200 style users weren't even close. Yo! That is it, that is it, that is it. And with it, we were able to secure first and second place. The female sack race started and it seems I was not the only one who had learned the forbidden technique. With the forbidden shuffle technique, um, this female secured victory. We then moved on to the next game, which was the Lyman Spoon. And as popular as this game is in Jamaica, I have literally never played it before. So I was unsure of which tech to use. But winging it never failed me yet. So by the hook nor the crook, we're going to do it. So by focusing all of my Rasta energy to the tip of my locks, 
I was able to keep firm and steady as I secured another victory. My prize, you may ask? The next game was a three leg race. I also have no experience with this as I don't know we are Jamaican, we're not tie ourselves for another man, but not on that. But as you can see, you know, I'm a brother and thing, so I think we can pass. We never do this before, so as you can see, we did a practice. Kinda never to work out. But yeah. It came down to the end of the evening and they started dancing on the stage. And of course, I took it upon myself to reach up on the people on stage, as apparently I always do. I had to show them some of our Jamaican style. So to conclude, this was a great day. It was good to do something different every now and again. I experienced the Indian lifestyle, we had fun, I learned about their culture, I tasted their cuisine, and despite the fact that I had no clue what most of them were saying 80% of the time, there was one universal language, and that is vibes. So yeah, you don't know as per usual, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment. What was your favorite part of the video? Let me know down in the comment section below.